welcome to my channel financial wisdom with energy i'm energy and in this video i'm going to be stuffing my goals my investments and my sinking funds before i get into it comment down below and let me know what is the thing that you are saving that you're the most excited about i think for me it's probably vacation because well we all know right none of us were really taking any vacation lately and i'm just excited to be going we're going to be doing miami for my sisters bachelorette party and then me and my husband are probably going to plan something so that we can celebrate our anniversary so i'm really excited to stuff that envelope and then let's see if you're not subscribed please consider doing that and leave a comment down below like i said you know let me know what you're you're ready to stuff that envelope for you're really excited for and please hit that like button it really helps me out and as a thank you i'm going to insert a picture a cute picture of pepper sleeping right here Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to move these out the way. Look at that, they fit perfectly in there. Oh, and I don't wanna to forget to let you know because I found out about this girl, Erica Kohlberg. She has, she's a lawyer, she has a YouTube channel, she has over 160,000 subscribers and she's having a free seminar on July 13th at 7 p.m. Eastern time. I am gonna be on there. I did her trademark seminar that she had and it was, I got so much good information and I know that she most likely will probably give a discount on her YouTube masterclass, so that's why I'm there. So I hope that you're able to join me. I'll leave a link down below. We're gonna start with our goals and vacation. Like I said, this is the one that I'm most excited to fill. I'm gonna put $25 in there. I have money over here. I'll let you know what that's about later on. And as you can see, there's a 1K in there, $25 for vacation. And now our vacation, our goal is $3,000, but now our vacation has 1,000, 20, 40, 60, 85, 1,085 dollars. So let's go ahead and update that over here. As you can see, some of my math was wrong over here. $1,085. Okay. Then our rental is gonna get $40. This is the money that we're saving to buy rental properties. And now that has 100, 200, 50, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 370, 390, 400 dollars. And our goal for that is 20,000. So we're a long ways away, but every little bit helps. You gotta take it a little bit at a time. All right. Now let's move on to our investments. And let me just, I just wanna make sure that we're on track here. All right, so let's go with, first thing is Jay's Roth IRA. He gets $125. All right, so now Jay's Roth IRA has 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 520, 540, 560, 580, 600, 625, $1,625. Of course, our goal is 5,000 so we can max it out this year. I believe it's 5,000. It's either 5,000 or 5,500. I think that's the most you can put into a Roth IRA. Whatever it is, I've done the math already. And I'm going to add 188 to mine. It's fake money, so it's 6, 20, 40, 60, 80. Yep, 80. Five, eighty-seven, 
position five two one so now my Roth IRA has one thousand two thousand one hundred two hundred and fifty two seventy two ninety three ten three thirty three fifty three seventy three ninety four ten four thirty four forty four forty two four forty three four forty four $2,443. So that's exciting. And the reason I have more than Jay is because I actually have to catch up. There was a few months that I didn't put money in there. The kids UTMA gets $26. And now they have 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 500, 5, 10, 15, 16, 516 dollars. Coinbase gets $12, and I don't count that, so I'll just stick that in there. I don't even know what I took it out. And Robinhood gets $12. All right, that's my purple binder. And now, let's go ahead and do the green binder, our sinking funds. Emergency fund gets 40. So now emergency, our emergency fund, which our goal is 7,000. Now it has 520, 40, 60, 80, 90, 600, 610 dollars. Is that right? Let's see. 520, 40. 60, 80, 90, $610. Our house maintenance gets $8. Two, four, six, eight. And now our house maintenance has 100, 200, 5, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 29, 30. So now this one has $620. And this right here, I don't know what I did, but we're going to cross this off and put 72 is $620. My I recorded this yesterday, but it was all messed up. The money just wasn't making sense. And then on top of that, the microphone stopped working. So actually it's a good thing that it messed up because that video was gonna be really bad if, if we published it. It just, I was all over the place. Like right now, right? So car maintenance gets $15. So let's see, two, four, I need a one. So I did that math wrong. Let's take a one out of here. Two, four, five. Gotta figure out what I'm doing wrong when it comes to putting the money in here for these three because it was also wrong the last time. I thought I checked it and obviously not. So car maintenance, now that one has 10, 20, 25, 27, 29, 31, 31, 33, 34, 35, 36. Thirty-six dollars. Seven two. Thirty-six dollars. Ten twenty-five. Twenty-five. Yeah. Okay. Right. 
Texas gets 30. And now that has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 40, 50, 150 dollars, which I, that is correct on there. And Christmas gets $12, so, all right, $12, see, look, there's a 10 there, gotta figure out where that, and I know some of you watching, you're like, oh my gosh, like, I know where you didn't put it. Uh, I guess once we look at the video, we'll see where I didn't put it, but I do know that, for example, Carmi should have 46, so I think that's where I went wrong. I'm gonna stick that in there because I think that's what I did wrong. I should have, I, even though I put 36, I did the math before and I should have 46. So now Christmas has, let's see. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 5, 57, 59, 60. So that's $360, and that is correct. So we're just gonna go back, because card maintenance should actually have, like I said, what was it? Should have 46. Stick that in there and change that to 46, because that's what it should be. So that's all my, um, that's all my, what are these called? These are all my notebooks. All right, so over here I have, so if you watched my last video, you know how much I saved in the month of July and I took the bulk of that money. I just took out a hundred and, it was like $155 and I shifted it over to this video because between the money that I have left, left over in my account, we had some extra money because my son's tuition was not due this month. They didn't, we didn't have to pay it and some other money that was left over. I'm gonna add it up. This is how much we had left over and I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with this money. As you know, in the other video, I sent the bulk of the money, all that money to pay off the house and now I gotta figure out what to do with this money. So. Starting off with 1,500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. So that's 1,000, what was that? 1,000, seriously, I just counted it. <laughs> All right, 1,500, 600, 700, 800, 900. 1,900 and $24, $1,924. All right, so we already talked about it with my husband and this $1,000 is gonna go towards our emergency fund. We really wanna get that nice and give it a nice bump. So that is my emergency fund is sinking funds, let's see. Yes, emergency fund. So we're gonna stick a 1K in there. That's gonna, that's like a nice bump up there. So. Let's add, so now 72, that's $1,610 that we have in there. And our goal, like I said, is $7,000. We also said that we wanted to bump, look at my notes over here. Okay, yes, we wanna do some home stuff, gonna fix some stuff around the house. So that's gonna get $500. So our house maintenance is gonna get $500. So now that one has 500, 600, 700, 700, 
stick that in there and it's supposed to be once we give it a boost it's supposed to be 730 500 600 700 5 10 12 14 16 18 20 22 24 26 28 29 30 that's right so that should be 730 which is right there see I had it right the first time okay all right of course all right and then what's left over is going to go towards our vacation fund which that one is under goals so let's see how much we have left over One hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred, four hundred and twenty-four dollars. Four hundred and twenty-four dollars. So now that has if the math math adds up that should have one thousand five hundred nine dollars let's see oh there's one thousand one hundred two hundred three hundred four hundred twenty forty sixty eighty five hundred five six seven eight nine yep one thousand five hundred nine dollars so we're over halfway on that and that's it no more money left to stuff so Thank you for staying till the end if you're still here. Obviously, if you're still here, you're watching, you're watching it, so you know you're staying stay till the end. I hope that you have a great week to your finances.